Hey guys, it is a sunny Monday morning here in Vietnam, bright and early. It's a little bit after 8 a.m. and I uh, wanted to get out early before it gets too hot so that I can uh, actually want to go down to the camera store or one of the camera stores over here, uh, look for a new, new lens for my camera. The lens that I shoot with, I, I shoot with a, um, an Olympus uh, OMD EM10 Mark II, and I'm using a 17 millimeter lens on it. I like this lens because it's really sharp uh, and it focuses uh, quickly and quietly, um, but it's a little bit narrow for what I want to do. So I'm gonna go look for a uh, wider angle lens at the shop. I looked on their website and they've got it listed there, but that doesn't mean they have it in stock and I'll, I'll bet they don't have it. I bet they would have to uh, get it from Hanoi or uh, Saigon. Uh, so we're going there to, to check that out, to find out uh, uh, what's the deal with that. The price is uh, on it, a um, little bit higher than in the US but we'll see if they can give me a discount. If you ask for a discount, sometimes they will. Um, and what else? So last night uh, was Sunday. I mean, yesterday was Sunday, and last night I went uh, and met up with Greg. I know you guys are a lot, there's a lot of people here from Greg's uh, channel. He's been, he's been talking about my videos, and uh, I appreciate that a lot. Um, he did a live stream yesterday, which was his 30-day uh, update on uh, the guy on a Cyclo transporting some goods. He uh, did an update yesterday about his uh, 30 days here in Da Nang or in Vietnam. And uh, man, I can't recommend that enough. You guys, uh, if you haven't seen it, go check it out. I'll put a link in the description of this video. And uh, he, he is absolutely spot on. I mean, he's a controversial guy. And uh, there's no doubt about that. And uh, he speaks his mind and, and offends people. But you can't argue. When the guy is, when the guy is on the money, he's on the money. And, and I, I couldn't disagree with anything that he said uh, on that video, uh, that live stream. Uh, and I was laughing because because it's amazing uh, to see his transformation from when he first came here. And I met him when he did his first live stream, or or, or maybe just after that. And to see how he's uh, uh, he's gone from um, his view of the place. You know, when he first got here, he was like, ah. Uh, you know it's okay but now he's sort of like he like he says in, in his video he says he feels he, he'll probably miss it uh, which funny enough I think I told him that on on his first the first day I met him I said ah when you leave you're gonna miss it because um, the same thing happened to me uh, when I when I first came to Vietnam uh, it's it's almost like an addict addictive place and it, it is because it's I mean as you can see around me there's just it's just colorful and like it's you know just stuff going on all the time it's just it's an exciting place even if you're just um, you know riding your bicycle to the street or to the to the store uh, down the street um, it's just fun it's just fun to get out and 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 see what's going on um, you know, it's it's like it's like an amusement park ride, and it's free. <laughs> you just you know you just you just uh, get, get on your bicycle or, or motorbike if if you like. Now, uh, some people said, well, why don't you, you use a motorbike for these videos? And I really couldn't. Um, you need both hands for a a, a motorbike, and. Um, and it would be it would be impossible for me to to hold the camera in in one hand and uh, 
and, and drive a motorbike at the same time. Uh, my, the motorbike that I have is a, is a motorcycle, so it's manual transmission, as if on me, Stan. It's a manual transmission, so I need my left hand to, uh, to clutch. Hey, come ga over here. And, um, and so a bicycle makes a lot makes a lot more sense. Plus, I like, I like the pace of using a bicycle. Uh, which way is this place? So this is the street it's on, this store. I think it must be over that way. And I'm gonna cross the street. Watch out for this ninja woman. So it's at 157. 157. The streets uh, in Vietnam are numbered, the, the uh, buildings are numbered sequentially. Odd, odd numbers on one side, let's see, 173, even numbers on the other side, but they don't match up. So if you look, look on one side, it'll say 167, and on the other side, it'll say uh, 102 or something like that. Uh, let's see, 165. Here we go. Here's the place. Hello. Hello. Oh, oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Almost ran over a guy. Guy. Go here. He's the security guy. Xin <laughs> chào. Oh, you work here? Yeah. <laughs> Do you have this one? Oh. Sorry, I can... You order? Have it here. You can order here. How, how long? Uh, uh, maybe tomorrow. Tomorrow? Yeah. Uh, okay. Can I... Uh, I can check for you. Okay. Yeah, so like I said, um, they will have to order it. So here's the Fuji's. I'm making a video, it's okay? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> here's the Fuji's that they have in stock. And uh, the Sony's that they carry. P6000. Yeah. Thank you. And uh, Canon over here. ESM50. That's a nice camera for doing the kind of stuff I do. And they carry Max, a lot of Apple products. And some used gear over here, a lot of Canon, Canon used gear. Okay. You have to uh, call, call. Call me. Oh, call you back. Okay. Yeah. So he spoke to somebody, and uh, they're going to call him back. Um, this is not unusual. Every every camera store I've been to, uh, they don't usually stock uh, Olympus. Uh, they'll stock Sony and and Canon. And, uh, and the, big, the big brands, Fuji and Nikon maybe. Actually, I don't see a lot of Nikon. You see Canon, but not Nikon. Uh, so this is uh, Win Van Lin. So if you take this uh, street, it'll take you to uh, the Han Bridge over the river. One of the sales girls that works here. There's a lot of banks on this street, a lot of ele electronic stores. Oh, she worked somewhere else. She was wearing the blue shirt like the, you know, she works at the bank or something. Let's see where she works. Uh, I don't know what it is. Real, oh, real estate, it's a real estate, real estate business. <laughs> I'm pointing a camera at their store. They're, they're looking at me. 
suspiciously. Yeah, they have the G7X Mark II. Emily, do you have a Mark III? Mark III. Uh, Is in Vietnam have or no? <laughs> no, I, I think. Uh, <laughs> I think it's so it's new, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this one. Can order. And you have in in Vietnam? Yes. Yeah. And how how many days? To tomorrow. Have it tomorrow if you tomorrow. if you order this one. Okay. One My friend uh, wants this one. Yeah. Uh, so <laughs> let me talk. Let's talk with him. So 20, 20, 20 million five hundred. You discount or no? Yeah, because it is new. This is dis. Ah, uh, it's new. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Okay. So that is the Canon G7X Mark III. They have it, uh, but it will take a day. So uh, they would have it tomorrow if, 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 if you want it, Greg. Only color black. Black? Okay. You, yes, no problem. You are the tomorrow. You have. Uh, have you must be other ten percent. Pay ten percent. Yeah, okay. And uh, is this price, or can you have discount on? Uh, you... Discount. Yeah, I can check. Uh, can I check him? Can I check for you? Yeah. Sorry, because he can't hear him. He cannot? He cannot. Okay. Okay. Um, you pay maybe one million tomorrow. You pay... Uh, okay. 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 Uh, they, uh, already they were to here. I will call you a message for you. Okay. okay. Thank you very much. Bye bye. Okay. So mission accomplished. Uh, So just like I thought, um, they don't have it in stock. No surprise. Um, so he ordered it. I had to give him. Uh, oh, by the way, this place uh, is. I call it just. I don't know if it's J Y S K, but if you're familiar with IKEA, uh, that that store is very similar to IKEA. Um, if you go and look online, you can see the, their furniture, but it's actually their, they, um, it's a little bit higher quality than Ikea. So if you're, if you're looking for uh, some uh, relatively um, affordable furniture that, that's modern and, and uh, affordable, that's a good place. And they also have home decorations and things like that. I should do a lot of my shopping there. Um, anyway, so yeah. He special ordered the lens for me. He says it'll take a day. So I'm going to come back tomorrow and pick it up. Uh, I think I'll, I'll probably put this video out today. Uh-oh, little somebody. Uh, 
somebody ran into somebody over here. And now I'm just heading back. I don't know why these, oh, there's a light over there, okay. So yeah, this is a nice uh, little shopping district. And um, that's, a good, that's a good example of why shopping malls here are really unnecessary. Uh, because um, uh, there's just little stores everywhere that sell just about whatever you need. And really, um, if, you, uh, if you find what you're looking for at one, it's going to probably be... Oh, this is a uh, VinFast Clara. That's an electric scooter. It's a new, it's a new, uh, new scooter. Uh, so if, if you find what you're looking for at one uh, store, wherever you go, it's going to be the same price. It's, it's almost like there's like a fixed price on, on everything. Uh, so shopping around doesn't really do you any good. Um, and they don't, they don't really have sales on stuff, you know, like, like waiting for uh, like a, uh, I don't know, New Year's sale or something like that, or a uh, uh, Black Friday event, something like that. They don't, they don't really do that very, very much. Uh, it's sort of the price, the price is what it is, and take it or leave it. Uh, by the way, all all of the prices in Vietnam include tax. So, if something is listed for you know whatever whatever it is, um, ten million, let's say. Uh, <laughs> this lady <laughs> just stopped and backed up, and anyway, so um, the price is what it is. Uh, you 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 don't um, uh, you don't have to pay tax on top of it. It already includes tax, which is nice because if you even go into a store uh, like uh, Vinmart and you want to buy a few items, you can you can look at it and and say, okay, that, that costs X and this costs Y, and then you add them up, and you know, if you, if you just uh, have a small amount of money in your pocket, uh, you, can, um, you can make a determination right away. You don't, have to, you don't have to think about tax on top of what, whatever it is. So anyway, uh, that's it for this video. I've been in this uh, street before. You're not gonna see anything new. But I'll let this roll just in case something interesting happens. But I'm gonna shut up now. So, if you notice, this one guy is beeping his horn. It's only this guy. And he looked like he was at least 60 years old. And you see that a lot, um, where it's the old people that are beeping their horns. The young people don't. I mean, now it's perfectly quiet. But you get one guy that's just beep, 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 beep. Yeah. Uh, but for the most part, the motorbikes are pretty quiet. Um, it's just the old people. Because they grew up in a time where that's, you had to honk your horn constantly. Now it's not, it's, not, uh, it's not really necessary. But that's their habit. And um, my point of this whole uh, rant is... Uh, those people will go away eventually. <laughs> so <laughs> the noise pollution as far as the horn honking uh, should get better over time. Because for the most part, the young people don't. Um, like my girlfriend doesn't, you know, when she's, when she's driving her motorbikes, I don't, I don't think I've ever heard her honking the horn. So that's it. I'm going to shut it off now, guys. Talk to you later.